I want to make sure that you know about a shooting that happened in Bradenton. Investigators say two people were wounded inside of a house on 6th Avenue East. This is just a couple miles away, a couple blocks, excuse me, from Manatee Elementary School. 10 News reporter Isabel Mascarenas is live there right now. And Izzy, there are some questions about whether deputies have the gunmen. Right, well, right now, the gunman, which in this case, according to Bradenton police, is the stepfather of both of these victims, is in custody. He has not been charged because the investigation continues here. Investigators are out here at this blue and gray house just behind me, carrying out a search warrant. Police say this is a family dispute that went all so wrong. Apparently, according to those on the street, it was all over one of the victims alleged drug dealing. It's a dispute that ended in gunfire with two victims shot, including a young boy. A neighbor's surveillance camera caught the first two Bradenton police officers rolling on scene. Bradenton police say a 911 call came from inside the home after 11 this morning. We're hearing the shooter was one of the victim's stepfather. Police have not said if the two victims are related. Neighbors tell us the older victim is 19 years old. Police say he's in critical condition. The younger victim, a 12-year-old boy, is in stable condition. Police say he was accidentally shot in the lower area. He's being treated at All Children's Hospital. He is talking to the police, asking them questions and stuff. So the, the child seemed yeah, conscious? He, he was conscious and and look like he wasn't bad off or nothing. The there. family is a good family, you know. I know some of the family from back in the 80s, you know, that I grew up with, you know, part of the family, and had never had no bad dealings with them. Now, a short while ago, Bradenton police did release the names of the shooter and one of the victims. The shooter is known as the victim's stepfather, as we mentioned, 36-year-old Joshua Rapola. The 19-year-old victim's name is Rufus Adams. He's at Blake Medical Center with gunshot wounds to the head and upper body. Once again, we're told he is in critical condition. Bradenton police believe this was an isolated incident. Their investigation continues. Reporting live from Bradenton, I'm Isabel Mascarenas, 10 News.